Holy bullocks. All right, because this, oh, oh my, R.I.P. Yo, 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 what up, guys? So Flux here, and today I have a gameplay with Faye. Obviously, I went mid with her. Her damage is just insane. I love her damage. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. If you guys do, please subscribe. You guys have uh, very big uh, bullocks, if you guys do. So let's get right into the build. First thing is, Am Crystal with two major casts and a strike. And then Am Crystal again with two strikes and a major cast. Brawler's Ward's gonna have two strikes and a minor strike. Burst Engines, all these are pretty much a temporary card in the beginning with all minor strikes. Same thing with this, all minor strikes, as well as the third one, all minor strikes. And then the last three cards are gonna have a Staff of the Adamin with all major casts. Same thing with this, but uh, advanced mana, a strike, and major cast. And then lastly, Hydroverser. Guys, I'm building up straight damage. I don't really like supporting with Faye. I think Faye could do more, so that's why I love going mid with her. I could hold it down like a champ, so that's amazing. And by the way, the fucking trick shot I did right before this damn scene. Amazing. House forgot the dick. So let's get right into the gameplay. Drama alert nation. Now I'm fucking around. Let's get what up all you she mills and all you tvs that are stale <clears throat> all right uh i tossed the jokes to the side you know the cringiness is uh real out here besides that i'm pretty much going fey mid lane obviously i don't play her as a support like i really do love the damage on her she just does a shit ton of damage as well as like you know helping team fights you know when you're maxed out and stuff like that this game the reason why i'm uploading this it was very stressful like i'm not kidding my brother and I, and pretty much he had a friend that was with us. We were all playing. We were shitting bricks, all right? I was sweating bullets, and it was just on another level. You know, my bullocks, you know, my bullocks pretty much dropped this game because, you know, I was on a different level. My brother and I, actually, he clutched it. I can't say, like, I did amazing, but I went nine up, and pretty much he did great. He clutched it at the end and went amazing as well as just the whole team. Shout out to the damn Decker, too. It was a random Decker. On our team, had 20 assists, was there every team fight, as well as gave us like shield, uh, quenching scales, stuff like that. Love that about, you know, supports. If you guys are all running a support, make sure you guys have those cards. So pretty much, he nearly clutched it. My brother, I sort of helped, you know, my alt really helped, you know, pushing people together, as well as, you know, the hauts on our team. Like, I'm not trying to be a douche. But he was pooping the bed. Like, I don't know what he was doing. He would go to their jungle, try to jungle their things, uh, get ganked. Like, it was his job. But, you know, just toss that to the side. You know, this Grox was doing good too, my brother's friend. So, that was good. But, like, you know, how to where are you going? Just tell me, where are you going? Obviously, want to chase him. And then, somehow, I just freaking pressed E, perfect timing, and then hit him with the far range shot. And then, same thing here. Like, guys, besides that, how to was just getting melted like 1v1 mid lane, I was destroying him. But besides that, I have to show you guys the ultimate kill, all right, that I've ever gotten in the history of histories because it was just unbelievable. It was on top of the game. I already showed it in the beginning of the damn video, but besides that, guys, it just really got my, uh, you know, my, uh, my ears hard. And then it was pretty nuts, honestly. Like, it was legit. It was sexy. It was a sexy shot. You know, if I had a 360 no scope in there, it would have been even better, but it's fine, you know. Tell that to the side, it's fine. And by the way, like, guys, I'm thinking that when COD comes out, or any other game, whatever, you know, I might play that. It depends, because a lot of this channel is based off, like, Paragon, so it's either a lot of people might not enjoy it, or a lot of people might. So, I don't know, we'll see. As well as, obviously, when I hit, like, 20k or something, I might vlog. I'm getting, like, a $2,000 camera for you guys. Hopefully, it's great, and at the same time, I'm getting cracked. So, nobody saw that. Pay attention to this E ability. I jumped in the air, fucking turned and hit him 174, made him do his ult. And then we all ended up destroying his life. He ended up getting away. I don't know how Grux didn't pull him in. I think it glitched or something. But they ended up chasing him down in our jungle and killing him. And then this Lieutenant Bellica. I hate that damn drone. Thing drains my mana like it's her job. Like it kills me. But I ended up doing my ult on this Yen and then spammed all my abilities. As well as we chased the Houtzer and ended up killing him as well. And then we pretty much clutched it. Guys, this game kept going back and forth. We pushed their inhib, their T2s, and it kept going back and forth, in and out. That uh, we almost lost, they almost lost. 
and it was crazy because our team fights were so equal at the same time we were off one person like i'm not kidding I'm not trying to be messed up but this howitzer man was off like he was really off every single freaking three minutes he was dead like r.i.p to him but you know i guess we always match up with people like that and then i chased down this damn Sevrog, and don't worry, I got him, guys. Just my frame went to fucking 300 to zero really quick, and then huh, it froze. So, you know, come on, Faye, you got this. Just start moving. Come on, game. You got this. All right. Uh, what the fuck happened? Because somehow I was just chasing him, it glitches instantly, freezes my screen, and then I'm, I'm dead. My brother's like, I died by a damn inhib. I'm like, what are you talking about? I was just standing still and I died. I'm like, how? How does that happen? I just have the worst luck. So I ended up alting the Zam Houser too. We ended up destroying all of them as well as we chased the Zam Lieutenant Belka and we ended up killing her. So regardless, if she almost got away, ended up doing my slowdown ability, but she died by my brother and then we had to defend mid. They really try to gank mid every single like three seconds, guys. I'm not kidding. Our mid, like I'm surprised that we didn't lose the inhib because they pushed it so hard. They were at least trying to gank us every like two seconds. I was almost about to die. We ended up pulling this damn Severog in. He ended up dying by my long ability and then that was an easy kill as well as we chased down the kill after uh, Houtzer ended up doing his ult. The thing is that his ult really helps. I thought he was gonna retreat, but he didn't and then we just destroyed his life. Besides that, we ended up going for Orb Prime after we like destroyed all of them. This Yin, I don't know how we didn't end up killing her earlier. I ended up doing all my abilities and it got stuck in her ult. But besides that, you know, she ended up killing the Grux and it was like BS because I felt bad. We ended up all were like trying to hit her. I hit her only like 60s besides my abilities. So as long as we won this fight, I was super happy because at this moment, like I didn't care about leveling, I didn't care about anything, like I really had the mindset of winning because the thing is, what really killed me was we would get into team fights where like down a person or something. So besides that, we killed all of them, went for Or Prime, which really clutched it as well because my brother needed Or Prime as well as Grux needed Or Prime. We all needed Or Prime in a way, and this is what really clutched it because every time we got into a team fight. They would just crash. Like, I'm not kidding. They're somehow going ham in our jungle. We don't know. They're all of a sudden, like, crashing my life out of me and stuff like that. So I hate the disadvantage on that, but it's fine. It was our fault for not even warding our jungle. I had, like, the mindset of making sure someone at least warded it, but I guess I was off. And then... I used my ult and everything on the Greystone that chased us because I was thinking about helping this like Houtzer, but I was like, you know what, I might die too, so I ended up just ulting using all my abilities on the Greystone. It was pretty stupid at the same time because I probably would have got away. And then, you know, at this moment, Greystone found me again and I was like, it's game over. But pay attention, I'm not done because all of a sudden, I'm about to die, jump in the air, kill Houtzer. This Houtzer, RIP to him because that was fucking kill cam. That was trick shot of the season, and don't worry, guys, I got away. I did not die. You know, obviously. Uh, all right, okay. Uh, game over from here. I think actually, uh, Severog was the only person alive at this moment. So we're like, it's either he pushes down mid, but we have all of our lanes pushed. So we might be at an advantage. And then I used my ability, and then perfect timing. I countered Houtzer's ability that bounces me back, so that probably would have clutched the game for them because, you know, I wouldn't have killed Houtzer. I wouldn't have done my all, wouldn't have got him, as well as we got this Yin. We chased him down. My brother was doing work with the Yin, and then we made sure, like, the second I was using my abilities, she did her all and she blocked my ability again, but it's fine because we're not done there yet. We're still pushing mid. I'm freaking happy at this moment because this game was very intense, like, it was like that game where you felt like you were going to lose and then something amazing happened in the game and then you guys all clutched it. And by the way guys, this might be off topic, but the thing is that I have these birds outside my window. You guys always say like, did you guys hear these birds? Like they're legit outside my window, pissing on it, shitting on it. I don't know what else to do. I feel bad if I put them in a fucking headlock. Like I don't know what I'm going to do. Like I, I'm like an inch away from putting them in a headlock. And, you know, fucking thinking, like, what the hell I should do with them. Because they legit have an orgy outside my window. So, beside my boys that are outside my window that guard me from, like, people. They're, like, pretty much my uh, neighborhood watch. You know, just in case shit happens. But, hopefully you guys do enjoy this. We wrecked the Greystone as well as the Sevrog came in after us and we destroyed it. So, hopefully you guys enjoy this. If you guys do, please drop a like. And make sure you guys subscribe. Thank you guys for all the support. Several got the dick. He's fucking. He has like 6,000 HP. I don't know why, but hopefully you guys enjoy this. 
I'm out. Peace.